Does this hat make me look boho chic or Woody from Toy Story? Boho chic. It's so cute. Okay, you're lying, but whatever. Can you just take a couple pictures for me? Yes, work it, work it, girl. Nine to five work. Mm. <laughs> okay, let me see. Oh, my stomach's sticking out weird. Can you take a couple from a lower angle? Okay, just get my legs. Yeah, a little bit lower. I just, just a little lower. Oh my god. You know, are you okay? I'm fine. Oh, I really need an Instagram boyfriend. <laughs> I really need to upload a new photo. I haven't gotten any likes in like an hour. You know suffering? I don't know, I haven't talked to her in a while. Are you mad at her or something? Are you not? Sung Ming told me she never kicked her drug habit. It's probably why she ended up in the hospital. She was on something. She lied to us, Noi. We're supposed to be her best friends. So how does avoiding her right now make sense? Uh, how about you take a couple pictures for me? What? Yeah. Okay, get some where I'm like casually chilling on the couch, drinking coffee. How they turn out? I think we got it. Okay. Are you for real? I can't use any of these. I really need an Instagram boyfriend. What about the photographer guy from the party? Zo? Yeah, he has been texting me since our last hangout. You mean me? Let's see what he's up to. So, how is seeing your mom? Is she gonna plan Robin and Oliver's wedding? Even though they'll probably end up like Ariana and Pete. It was okay, actually. My mom said she was proud of me. Whoa, coming from an Asian mom, that's like, better than an I love you. As she asked about Yuna, I think she knows. I think everyone knows that you like Yuna, except for Yuna. Say lovey. Yeah, she said that I deserve to be loved back. I've been telling you that since freshman year to move on from Yuna and from liking straight girls in general. I can't move on yet. I think I'm gonna tell Yuna. Whoa, that's major. When are you gonna? Zo just texted back. He has a work trip in Portugal and asked me to go with him. Oh my God. No, I told us, but you're seriously going? Come in. So exciting. Let's help you back. How can you be so sure you're not getting taken? You don't have a very particular set of skills. It would be a pretty expensive long play if Zo took me to Portugal just to kill me. Oh, you love Portugal. Do you remember for my 21st birthday, my parents brought us to Madeira for a wine tour? Yeah, that looks so fun. We're just going to Lisbon, though. But hey, I just need social media pictures. Maybe Zoe will be my Instagram boyfriend. Ooh, boyfriend? <laughs> Flying to a foreign country with some guy you've been on like two dates with has got to be the craziest thing anyone has ever done for the gram. I've seen a girl stand on a chair at a restaurant to take pictures of her avocado toast. That's crazy. You know, you're being a drag. She deserves this. Go. Have fun. Plus, she's a teacher. This is the purpose of having a spring break. A cute guy whisking you away to a foreign country. Girl, get it. <sighs> she doesn't need to be a gold digger. She's not gold digging. She's gold accepting. I'll be fine. I'm going to vlog the whole thing. And if I go dark, call Liam Neeson. Hi, it's your girl Cece coming at you from SeaTac Airport. Welcome to my Portugal vlog. Let's go. Hi, we landed in Lisbon last night and it's so lovely here already. First thing on my agenda though is to get natas, which are Portuguese egg tarts. Let's go. Hong Kong egg tarts that I grew up eating. Oh, look at that. 
That wall is very Instagrammable. Ooh, how cute. Want to pick it for a bit? Oh, look at you being a good Instagram uh, homie. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, my hair looks so weird in that, and my legs. Can you can you just take a couple more? Sure. Actually, do you mind getting it from like a lower angle? Um, I'm sorry, just like a little bit lower. Yeah, I you know like just to like, kind of elevate the look, like just a bit look. Yeah, from there. I'm gonna do like a fake walk one, okay? That. I think so. Okay. Thank you. Looks like Cece's living it up in Lisbon. Eating pastries, pastéis de natas. Why does it sound so sexual? It'd be more interesting if it was. <laughs> I guess she made it into Portugal in one piece. Zoe isn't a serial killer yet. Uh huh. I told you everything will be just fine. Maybe she won't need me anymore. To take pictures, I mean. Can't imagine you're too sad about that. I mean, I didn't mind it. It was fun taking pictures and just hanging out. What are you doing? What the hell? Are you on Tinder? Just for shits and giggles, no big deal. Um, big deal, you're engaged? About that. Do you ever drink hot coffee anymore? <laughs> well, I mean, it's like I ordered an iced latte. Bye. You won't believe this. Robin's back on Tinder. I bet she kills it on Tinder. Asian girls always do. Well, yeah, everyone loves a cute Asian girl. Asian guys, on the other hand, we get no love. When I was on that app, I got like two matches. And I'm pretty sure one of them was my second cousin. Hell on? Yes. But, uh, you know Brock and Jared. Your white frat brother friends? Yeah. Those guys get more swipes on Tinder than Charmin on a butthole. <laughs> You're missing the point. Robin's engaged. I don't know if she gets bored. The girl lives life like she's on Molly. The high doesn't last forever. Still, I thought it'd last longer than that. Don't people take marriage seriously anymore? Well, they only dated for a month. You should be together for at least five years before you're sentenced to life. We've been together for five years. I mean, ten years. Wait. Tinder didn't exist when we started dating. When were you on it? What? Earlier, you said how Asian guys don't get swiped right on Tinder. Are you... Are you on Tinder? No. Let me see your phone. No. Are you fucking on Tinder? No, you're crazy. Is that how you met Mary Park through that app? I don't have to take this. You're hiding shit too. What are you talking about? You think I didn't know about this? Wait, this, this doesn't even have to do with me right now. I'm not the one who's cheating. I'm not cheating. Just swiping. I'm going to ask you one last time. Are you swiping while we're dating? And like I said, I only got two matches. It's a voice in the deep and it's oh calling God, for me. Oh, just go and get out. Yeah. No, no, you need to come over. Right. I need I you right now. Get out. Yes. Out. Yes. Did you have fun today? Yeah, it was great. I didn't realize bloggers work so hard. <laughs> There's definitely a lot that goes into it. I mostly work hard to make it look like I didn't work hard for a photo. Whatever gets those likes. I mean, I like taking pictures. It's like, if I didn't capture it, it didn't happen. But are you enjoying life 
as it's happening? Of course. Sure. I guess. I don't know. I mean, I've always documented everything. I wrote in my diary every day as a kid. I wrote for the school paper in college. Maybe that's why I became an English teacher, to share stories. Have you written any stories lately? No. Instagram stories are faster, and people like pictures, even if they're a heavily filtered and staged version of reality. You know what they say, a picture's worth a thousand words. Yeah, but where are your words? Are you okay with them just being IG captions? What made you start documenting everything? I thought that if I could capture time, then I could make it not so ephemeral. That's what makes time beautiful. It runs out. Simon, hey. Oh, shit. Yuna, what's going on? I came as soon as you called. I think Solomon and I just broke up. We used to be here